Hey guys, Homer for Tech from TechInform.us, and today we have part of the lifestyle section of TechInform.us, a pair of Costa Del Mar Bonita sunglasses. These are the Bonitas with the polarized 400 lenses, black lenses, um, and the glossy black frame with the silver side inlay and black Costa Del Mar symbol. Uh, these glasses are going to run you $149 from the Costa website and uh, they include this case and of course sunglasses and Costa's one year warranty uh, not one year, lifetime warranty which covers any manufacturer detail so let me tell you what manufacturer detail means that means anything that Costa has done wrong, not anything you do wrong so you drop it and they get all scuffed up and you want to replace something you have to pay for that yourself and repairs on these pair of glasses particularly can get fairly expensive I'll show you what I mean later in the review. The case that you that it comes with um, kind of actually resembles an Oakley soft vault. It does kind of look like one too, um, though it is blue and does have the Costa symbol on it. Um, not all of the cases for um, Costas are the same blue. Um, I actually do like the blue. Some people do not. Um, on the zipper, it just says. Costa, and inside it just looks like that, um, and it actually doesn't seem to like to stay closed, it seems to flap open and close the lock. So let's head that to the side and get to the actual glasses themselves. Now let me start off by saying that these glasses have some of the best lenses that I've ever worn. Clearest lenses, um, most scratch resistant, really just a pair of the best lenses I've ever looked through. They make the world pop. They make greens greener, blues bluer, the sky just looks amazing, water looks amazing. But getting to the water part, that's mostly what Costas are used for is outdoor sports. That's why the lenses are so phenomenal. Um, if you take another brand like Oakley, um, that's really the only brand I can think of. Not all of their glasses are polarized, that's an extra option. All of Costa's glasses are polarized. That's what makes them so special, since you don't have to opt for that. There's two different levels of polarization that actually come on this, the level 400 and the level 580. Uh, level 580 are phenomenal. I have the 400s, but um, getting a 580 would be really nice, but those are about $250. Um, Glasses are designed very well. This is how they look here. Very nice design. They stay on your face. And truthfully, after wearing them for an hour, an hour and a half, two hours, five hours, out on the water, driving around, uh, you don't you forget that they're on your face pretty much after ten minutes. They're probably one of the most comfortable pair of sunglasses I've ever worn. Um, the lenses are made of glass, so if you drop them, from any decent height, the lenses may and are subject to cracking, uh, which is not, um, which actually not, I'm sorry, which actually happens, um, dealing with Costa forms, app actually happens quite often. So uh, definitely, if you're clumsy, if you're um, if you're throwing your glasses around a lot, I really don't recommend these glasses if you are really hard at work. Uh, get something with a plastic lens that's not going to break or shatter as easily. Um, these glasses are made in China. They are gla glossy, which is very subject to fingerprint. Let me see if I can focus in on this here. Should be able to. Get a little further away. Uh, I don't know if you can see this, but there are a ton of fingerprints on these. And I actually just cleaned them off before this review. I didn't actually wear gloves in this because I wanted to show you how truthfully fingerprint ridden they get. Now the lenses themselves uh, really don't attract that many fingerprints um, or water because they do have an anti-water and anti-fingerprint uh, spray or um, I want to say stain, but uh, spray on them which uh, does its best to repel water as best it can, and fingerprints. Very much like an iPhone screen, well an iPhone 3GS or iPhone 4 screen. Um, something I must note is that these glasses get scratched very, it's not going to focus up this close, but 
These glasses get scratched very easily. If you can see up in the right hand corner there, scratch there, scratches down here. Um, I accidentally dropped them from a height of only about two feet onto right there and uh, that's what happened. So luckily the lens didn't crack so the lens is that strong enough but unfortunately it did do that. Um, so thank you for watching this review here. Uh, don't forget to subscribe, rate, and comment. And check out uh, some other of our Tech Inform writers that have YouTube channels. Ryan Knows Tech, Joe the Techie, the Techie One, and I believe um, Colt 9545, I don't know, Colt. Write down what you use down there. Also check out the KRBR, though not directly related to techinform.us. He is one of our writers, very good friends, and makes, in my um, humble opinion, excellent videos. Thanks for watching. Te check out techinform.us at www.techinform.us. And um, we're going to be releasing our, our second version of techinform.us fairly soon. So, look forward to that. Uh, look forward to more videos from this Forum for Tech channel. And have an excellent day. Thank you for watching, and goodbye.